looking at the A55 trying plane made here at H&T Gordon. The A standing for, for adjustable and the 55 is the blade pitch when the blade's in bevel down. You can also use this plane as a cabinet scraper simply by reversing the blade to bevel up which gives you an 85 degree scraping angle. You have a choice of blades in this plane. One is a high carbon tool steel and one is a high speed M2 high speed steel blade. It has a protective coating on it that just peels off. Now if you're planning timbers like cedar, blackwood, silky oak, you know, your furniture grade timbers or from overseas uh, maple, walnut, that type of furniture timber, then really all you need is a high carbon tool steel blade. But if you get into Australian hardwoods or an overseas hardwood where you find you have to scrape a lot by reversing the blade, the high speed steel will hold a better edge when you're scraping. So blade up, put the first hole over the small post in the adjuster. The second hole in the blade is just for when the blade starts to get worn out. That just clips over there. It's quite a tight fit so you don't have any backlash in the blade. And you leave a cap or wedge, make sure the bolt isn't protruding when you go to put it in so that it fits nicely down, right down into position. I just hold the wedge in with my thumb and do my lateral adjustment. So you put plenty of blade through so you can see the blade clearly. Laterally adjust it and then wind it back to what you think is a nice cut. Making sure it comes back evenly. Another little trick here, you can, if you want finer lateral adjustment, a little mallet to tap it into position, it also works well. Um, then you lock off your lever cap nut and give it a try. That's cutting pretty nicely on this piece of silky oak. So work your way across the board. It's probably still a couple of little highs and lows in this board. Yep. If you want to do a further adjustment, say we want to go a little bit finer, always for any adjustment back your the lever cap bolt off and then do your fine adjustment. A tenth of a turn will change the depth by about 1,000 of an inch. As you can see now we're into a very fine shape. But for final finishing of certain pieces of wood, a really fine shaving like this can give you a really good result. For more information on using this plane, it comes with a full instruction on care, maintenance, sharpening, uses. We also have a, a comprehensive website with information and also our YouTube channel um, has shows using all our different types of planes.